begin building the page, it's important to understand what it means to build a web page. Then, we'll elaborate on the different ways Elementor allows you to build a page and which method will suit you best based on your goals. The Elementor Editor isn't just a web design platform. It's a website builder. A web page doesn't have a predefined size. Some web pages are short, while others are long, and their width varies according to the screen size. When working with the editor, you're actually building the page itself and defining its size during the process. By adding containers to the page, you're actually building the page, so every container you add adds a new area to your page. The container structure is what defines the page's layout. After you create the page's layout, you can add content to the containers by adding widgets, define functionality using forms or links, and set the behaviors you want, such as motion effects and animations. You have four ways to get started on the page building process. The first way is the blank canvas method, where you start with a clean slate and build all aspects of the page from scratch. To start, click on the plus icon, add your containers. Choose some widgets and define each element's design, functionality, and behavior. The second way is a bit faster. Click on the library icon and choose one of the assets. Using this method, you can add pages and blocks and modify them to fit your design and content. Through your WordPress dashboard, under Templates, you can access the kit library. Here, you'll find a variety of full-size kits. Choosing a kit will allow you to automatically install all of the website components onto your site. Components can include pages, posts, pop-ups, forms, templates, menus, and design assets and settings. The third way to build your page is by using a wireframe kit. Wireframe kits give you an outline and recommendations as to where your content should be placed. The fourth way is to use a professionally designed kit and simply modify the existing content to personalize it and make it your own. If your goal is simply to have a website and you don't have any specific design in mind, it's best to start with a full site kit. If you want to save time and effort planning, a wireframe kit will be the way to go. Wireframe kits will allow you to jump right into creating the design and content. If none of the kits suit your needs, the best thing to do is use the library assets and simply edit them. If you have a specific design in mind and enjoy the creative process, you'll probably want to go with the blank page method and create the layout, design, content, and define the functionality of the page yourself. If you choose to create your own design from scratch, it will take a bit longer, but you'll be sure to get the professional, pixel-perfect website of your dreams. For more information on the library and the full site kits, visit Elementor's Help Center.